Okay, so let's uh, take a look at this op amp where the differential voltage, uh, sorry, the differential gain is given by 10 and the common mode gain is given by 1. Okay, and let's say what we do is uh, maybe let's make a table here. So let's say what's the values of V1, what's the values of V2. And let's start with values, let's give V1 as let's say 1 volt and let's put V2 as 2 volts. Okay, and what we want to calculate now is the output voltage. And to do the uh, calculate the output voltage, let's calculate the uh, output because of the differential voltage ADVD and let's calculate the output due to the common mode voltage which would be given by ACM VCM okay and let's calculate the total V out okay so let's try to do these calculations so what is the voltage here going to be what is ADVD going to be so what is VD so that is v1 minus v2 right the, that's the difference of the voltages so v1 minus v2 is here minus 1 volts uh, and that is multiplied by ad which is 10 so minus 1 times 10 so it's minus 10 volts so we get minus 10 okay now what about acm times vcm or the common mode voltage at the output so what is vcm VCM is V1 plus V2 over 2, right? So what we have is 1 plus 2, that is 3, divided by 2, 1.5 times 1, which is 1.5 volts. So this is going to be 1.5. And therefore, what is your V out going to be? Your V out is going to be minus 8.5 volts. Is that all right? Does that make sense? So... So so the so there is a so there is a amplification of the differential voltage. There's an amplification of the common mode voltage, and both of them add together to give you the output voltage. Let's take a look at uh, a slightly different situation, and in this case, let's take one volt and one volt. Okay, and in this case, you can see that the differential voltage is going to be zero. So the output due to the difference difference is going to be zero. But in the common uh, mode, you will have one, right? Because VCM is one plus one over two, which is one and ACM is one again. So one times one is one and therefore the V out is going to be one volt. So you gave V1 and V2 as one volt and one volt and you got V out as one volt. Now what happens if you give 10 volts and 10 volts? Again, you will have zero and then you get 10 volts here and then you get 10 volts here. So you can see that because of this common mode gain, it is no longer true that the op amp uh, only uh, gives you an output, a non-zero output, when the difference of the signals is greater than zero, right? Or different from zero.